a parallel plate capacitor connected to a battery becomes fully charged, after which the plates are pulled farther apart so that the plate separation triples, as the battery remains connected to the capacitor. By what factor does each of the following change? Capacitance, the voltage across the capacitor, charge on each plate of the capacitor, potential energy stored in the capacitor, and the electric field between the plates. C equals to epsilon naught A over D for parallel plate capacitor. The epsilon naught is always a constant, and in this case, the plate area doesn't change either, so the capacitance is proportional to 1 over D. And the plate separation triples. D triples, so the capacitance becomes one-third of its old value. The voltage. Since the battery is staying, that means uh, this battery is going to maintain the same voltage. A battery has a certain voltage. For example, a 9 volt battery keeps a 9 volt voltage difference across its two terminals. The positive terminal would have a 9 volts higher pot electric potential than its uh, negative terminal. So if the battery stays there, it is going to maintain the same voltage. Q. Q equals to CV. Because the voltage is going to stay the same, so the Q is proportional to the capacitance. And the capacitance becomes one-third. What does this mean? This means that in order to maintain constant voltage, the battery has to pull some charges back. So now the capacitor holds less charge. Energy stored in the capacitor, that's one-half QV. One-half never changes. And the voltage is, in this case stays the same as well. So the energy stored in a capacitor is proportional to the charge on the plates, and the charge becomes one-third. So the energy stored in the capacitor changes by a factor of one-third. So the capacitor now stores less energy. Now for the electric field. It's the electric field between a set of parallel plates oppositely charged. So the electric field in between the two plates is uniform. That means we can use V equals to ED. That means E equals to V over D. The voltage now is a constant. So the electric field is proportional to 1 over D. And since D triples, the electric field changes by a factor of 1 third. With 1 third the charge on the plate, the number of field lines in between the plates becomes 1 third. So the field line density becomes 1 third. The field strength becomes one-third its old value.